Namaste fam, Wolfgore here, and welcome back to Sekiro. I tried, I tried to live stream on YouTube again on the PC, and it just doesn't work. YouTube hates me. No matter how low I put the bitrate, just frame drops, frame drops, frame drops, which on your end means lag. And uh, that's fine. We're back on Twitch. We'll stream on YouTube tomorrow on the PS4, and it'll be fine. Um... But, ah, uh, why is YouTube so frustrating? Anyways, hi guys, Wolfgore here. You may have noticed that I have a holy moonlit sword and a very lewd outfit on. That is because yesterday I spent many hours modding Sekiro. Uh, I didn't do any game-changing mods. I might look into that in the future, but for right now it's just going to be cosmetic. And uh, also, I just posted a video on YouTube um, that I've been wanting to post for a very long time talking about how I am going to try to buy my mom a house uh, over time with the money that I make off of this channel. So if you're watching this, just putting the word out there. I'll probably be putting the word out there a lot for a long time. Um, so any any donations, any ad revenue, any uh, Patreon subscribers, any money that the Wolfcore channel makes, that money is going to go towards uh, a fund to try and buy my amazing mother a house. And uh, if we eventually reach that goal, I'll be sure to record it and make an amazing video where we both probably cry. Uh, but with that having been said, why don't we play some Sekiro, shall we? In the last Sekiro live stream, we finally defeated Genshiro in New Game Plus One. So we need to go back to the Ashina Castle and follow up with uh, what happened there. Talk to the kid. And, uh, yeah. See what else there is to do. Because there's a lot more to do. Hi, Abba. Oh. At long last, I've managed to fulfill my master's order. I give you my thanks. Who exactly do you serve? Ishin Ashina. <clears throat> I am a doctor in the service of Lord Ishin. Why were you ordered to help me? Lord Ishin has no desire to use the power of the dragon's heritage. That is why he... He tried to help Lord Kuro escape Ashina. Correct. The message I found in the well, that was your doing? Also correct. My duties have concluded, but there's someone I think you'd like to see, Lord Kuro. Is downstairs. Fancy. Well, let's say hello. Hey, what up, kid? Stop jumping. I have come for you, my lord. Yes, you did well to come here. Let us go. We must leave Ashina. Wolf, my blood. The blood of the dragon causes men to become undying. The same goes for you. Yes, my lord. I wished to save you. I'm sure that I would do the same thing given another chance. However, undying begets stagnation. The immortal oath, the rejuvenating waters, the dragon rot, they all corrupt men to the point that they no longer live as men. I wish to sever the chains of stagnation bred by the dragon's heritage. Wolf, will you help me achieve this aim? Uh, sure. What happens? I, I I said help Kuro last time. What happens if I hit obey the Iron I Code? Not. To protect you, the Divine Heir. That was the duty my father entrusted to me. How many times have you died and come back to life for my sake? Two, three times? Yeet! What's up, Mecca? How are you, player? Large, that it cannot be counted. As it was for the purpose of defending my lord, the number does not matter. I do not wish to bind you to an eternity of undeath. Wolf, join me in my quest to sever the ties of immortality. As you wish. Thank you, loyal wolf. Ugh, gross burp. Alright. You got anything else if to say? If you are seeking to sever the immortal ties, I know a good place to start. Wolf, look at this. The 
immortal severance text. The record that was kept in Ashina Castle. Sacred dragon tears. Yes. Mm -hmm. It is mm -hmm. my book. Dragon tears. Uh huh. Divine I realm. Uh huh. Wolf. Uh huh. That it belonged uh -huh. to. Uh huh. Uh huh. You know, just stressed about a job. Lol. How about you? how you been? Oh, dude. I'm sorry. Yeah, we need to catch up. Maybe this weekend if you're free. I want to know what's going on with your job, Sitch. But uh, I've been good, dude. Just uh, just chilling. I modded the fuck out of Sekiro, <laughs> and I like it better now. <laughs> and I also finally posted that video that we talked about like a while back about trying to buy my mom a house. So that's officially happening now, which is exciting. And uh, yeah. Yeah, finally, uh, officially a YouTube partner as of, like, four days ago. And, uh, the views from the channel are actually making me, like, five bucks a day, which is pretty cool. So, that's pretty neat. But, yeah. Other than that, that's about all that's going on. Alright, so. I want to go to the Divine Realm. Which means... Where do we need to go next? Uh, if I leave, will he open up the library? Because I need to get in that library and get a key. Huh. Wolf, that ends it yeah, yeah, yeah. To a Is there something special about it? I'm told that long ago... There was another divine heir living here in Ashina Castle. His name was Lord Takeru. This incense burner belonged to him. Where is he now? He died a long time ago, apparently. Wrapped in the aroma of the fountainhead, I returned to the divine realm. Those are supposedly the words he left behind. You're saying the scent of the fountainhead is the key to reaching the divine realm? That is my belief, Wolf. Let us discover the truth together. All right. Yeah, I have something maybe with Dodge. Oh, cool. And yeah, I saw. Let's get her that house. And very nice. Congrats. Thank you, sir. We're going to do it. It's going to be a journey, but I'm buying that woman a house. Gosh darn it. <laughs> All right. Where do I go next? Go open up the damn library, kid. Do I just have to keep talking to you? Now, as to how we begin our search, I am certain some of Lord Takeru's books remain in this castle. Books that he collected in order to find the Divine Realm. I will search for them. In addition to finding a way to reach the Divine Realm, might we also look into how we might sever the immortal ties? A fine suggestion. Talk to Ishii. If anyone knows the answer, it is him. Wolf, come with me. Okay. The mods are in place, I see. Hey, what's up, Cross Prophet? How you doing, brother? Sorry, I keep messing with my settings. There we go. Good walk. Lord Ishin is not within this castle citadel. I'm told he is recuperating in one of these watchtowers. However, the path to his watchtower is closed. Is his it? health is a little... How do I get in? On the roof. There's a path patrolled by the Nightjar Ninja. It's intended for Shinobi. But I imagine that won't be a problem for you. I've heard the Nightjar use smoke signals as landmarks. Yes, so if you follow their smoke signals, you should be able to reach Lord Ishin, and you can use this window to reach the roof. I'm doing good. Ran out of propane. God damn it, Bobby. And burned my hand today. Dude, I'm sorry. I hope your burn is okay. But, uh, yeah. Make anything cool yet? I think that's Ishin's digs over there. 
So let's go say hello. 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 Mm. Okay, but how do I get inside though? Oh, here we go. Wrong house. Hey, what's up, dude? About the Divine Heir's life. Yes? There is something I wish to ask. Uh, before that, Saki. What? You earned it. Take it. Saki. My grandson, Genichiro, was bewitched by the rejuvenating waters. You did well to put a stop to that for me. You have my thanks. I merely followed the code my father taught me. Ah, the Iron Code of the Shinobi. I see. So you're the son of Owl. That boy he found during the rebellion. Yes. And your travels brought you here. <laughs> the bonds that tie us are so deeply amusing. Don't you think, Sekiro? You're... So what do you wish to know? a small burn can't finish my blades because one of them messed up the only belt i had for my belt sander ah oh, bummer dude well belts probably aren't too expensive so i'm sure you can get another one pretty soon the divine heir's desire is to sever the ties of immortality i want to know how it can be done the mortal blade if you had such a weapon it may be the key to what you are after the mortal blade with it you could kill one who cannot die through normal means. One who cannot die? The infested, I believe they are called. I have not seen one before, but it's said you could stab them through the heart, or remove their head, and they wouldn't die. <laughs> if the stories are true, they'd surely be quite fearsome. Mm. To kill a monster such as that, you need the mortal blade. Where is Give this it to mortal me. blade? I have heard it's held in Senpo Temple. However, they say the mortal blade cannot be drawn. What do you mean? I am not certain of the meaning. It's just hearsay. Hmm. The gates to that temple are closed now, though. Who knows what those degenerates are doing shut away up there in the mountains. There aren't any decent roads leading there. Hmm. Oh. Nope. You're leaving, Sekiro. Severing immortality. That will be quite the battle. And in battle, the plans and desires of those involved churn endlessly. If you hesitate, you'll be swept away. And lose the battle. <laughs> That's right. Best you keep it in mind. Sekiro, hesitate, and you lose. All right. Yeah, it's going to be a journey for sure, but we'll do it. Hell yes, brother. That is the spirit. Just like three years ago, when I tried live streaming my first time and I had no idea what I was doing, But we knew it was going to go places. Same thing. Just another bigger step in the journey. And it's going to be awesome! Alright, maybe I should talk to the kid again. Who the fuck is sneezing? That was adorable. Yeah, okay. Alright, he's finally in the library. Got the gun, fort, shrine, key. <clears throat> oh, this dust is awful. I have returned. Oh, Wolf, you're back. Did you meet with Lord Ishin? I did. He said the mortal blade, it could be the key to severing immortality. The mortal blade? It's a sword that has the power to kill the undying. It can be found at Senpo Temple. I see. Yes. That seems promising. As you say. For my part, 
I hunted for any books that may contain clues about the aroma of the Fountainhead. It seems Lord Takeru indeed sought a way to reach the Divine Realm. So far, I found one piece of relevant information. What is it? A flower. Mm, a flower. First, read this. Fragrant flower note. A note from Kira written by Takeru, former heir of the Dragon's Heritage. It is said that relatives of Tom Tomato once gathered the fountainhead fragrance and arrived at the palace. You may find a key where the waters of rejuvenation converge in a deep pool. A white and deeply fragrant what flower. Is? Lord Takeru left it behind. I was looking for information on the fountainhead aroma and how it relates to the divine realm. There is water that flows from the fountainhead through Ashina, and the book speaks of a white lotus flower that grows where the water pools deeply. It appears to be one component of the fountainhead aroma. A place where the fountainhead waters pool deeply, perhaps in a deep valley? Yes, indeed. The sunken valley may be the place. The fountainhead waters should flow into there. Where is this sunken valley? It's beyond the woods to the rear of the castle. There's a shrine dedicated to the white serpent deep in the woods. I've already As been the there. Name implies, the sunken valley is just below that place. There's no proper path down there. But a man of your talent could navigate it. Oh, that's right. That door marked with the outline of a person. Lord Ishin once called it a shinobi shortcut. I haven't a clue how it works. But seeing as he mentioned Shinobi, I thought you might know. What door? What door? I was playing D&D &D today as a hobgoblin artificer and had to reattach my hand that was removed because of a grappling hook. Damn, that's hardcore. What ending are you trying to get this run? Um, I think I'm going to obey the iron code and see what happens there. It's not the ending I want to do, but... I do want to experience them all, so we're going to do it. Oh, hello. Mm, scrap magnetite. All right, so we need to head back over to Zigun Fort. Oh, that's the door. Did I go through this my first time? Or is this just the one that connects back to the dilapidated shrine? I think it is. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's a little weird. That the top of the castle just happens to connect right there. I don't know. I don't know about that. Alright, so let's head back to the gun fort and see about killing a big-ass ape. And getting a shiny white flower. Ba, ba, da, ba, da, ba. Gun fort. Become a demigod. Well, if you insist. Hey, Maria, how are you? I'm good. I am very good. Having a good day. And, uh, ready to do a little bit of progression in Sekiro. How are you doing, though? Snick. Snick. Ah! Oh. Snick. Ah! Ah! <laughs> you can't find me here. Okay, I like the mods you added to the game. Thank you, me too. Probably gonna look into doing some actual game altering mods in the future, but for the time being, we're just gonna keep it cosmetic. Damn fish.
Nice. Ah! Bitch, can't get me in here. Sadly, no mods for Bloodborne. I know, it's such a tragedy. If Bloodborne had come out on the PC, that game would have had so much more longevity to it. Oh well, nothing to be done for it now. Oh yeah, this area. I forgot about this. Whoa! Buddy. Watch it. Yeah. How do you like them apples? Whoa! Who in the fuck has the audacity to shoot at me? Fucking monkey. Ow. Fuck off. Speaking of PC, did I tell you I'm going to try and cash out my 93 hours of PTO and start my build finally? Dude, you did not, and that is very, very exciting. Ooh, I'm happy for you. It's going to be so sweet once you have a PC and we can do PC stuff together. Not politically correct stuff, obviously. <laughs> you know what I mean. Because of the new, new updates, all the axes cost two spirit emblems. What? No shit, really. <gasps> oh, that's so good. That's so good. I love it. I should probably read those patch notes. Hella stoked, dude. I'm hella stoked for you. 93 hours of PTO. That's a good chunk of money. That's... Like, that's enough to get your PC, like, right there. And I'll see if I've got that motherboard and processor from my last build in the RAM. Because that could save you a lot of money. It's like $400 worth of equipment that I just have lying around. Assuming that I got it back, which I'm assuming I did. I'm going to be really pissed if Fry's didn't give that back to me. Of course not, what am I, some sort of cuck loser? Obviously, dude. Fucking obviously. <laughs> ow! 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 Fuck! Alright. Could've played that better. Could've tried, you know, deflecting. Can't handle my moonlit sword, batch. Yeah, that would help a lot and be much appreciated. Absolutely, I will try to remember to check after the live stream. I keep telling myself I'm going to check, but I forget. What the fuck is the lore behind gun sword wielding monkeys? That is a damn fine question, and I wish I had an answer for you. I have not been keeping up on my Vati Vidya lore videos. I haven't watched any of his Sekiro coverage yet, which I'm assuming he's doing. But yeah.
That's a shit ton of monkeys. That is not what I was trying to do. Fuck off. Wow! Shit, did I just die for real? I suck. Hey, what's up, V9? How are you, brother? Zup, zup? Why I only get one zup today? Where's my second zup? <laughs> I'm hoping that when Sekiro learned how to move like a monkey, that the monkeys also learn from him. That's definitely it. You cracked the code, my friend. Is that the moonlight? <laughs> LOL, okay then. Yes! <laughs> Yeah, I messed around with modding yesterday, because I was bored. Yeah. Not Sekiro, Sekijo. I don't even know who that is. I don't know characters. You see the guy with the mask with the big nose? You already know more about the lore than I do. Yeet! Fuck off. Now. That's Ishin. Sekiro is the sculptor. Oh. Oh, Sekijo is the sculptor. Sorry, I'm thinking the names correctly, pronouncing them incorrectly. Wait, Ishin is the guy that you run into that gives you the quest to, like, hunt the rats and stuff? The dude with the mask with the big nose? That's Ishin? Oh, shit. I might have got confused there, but if that is what you're saying, that's fucking cool. I had no idea. Ugh, do I want to go down there in the poison? Not particularly. I mean, I'm going to have to go down there eventually, but... That is Ishin. What? I had no idea. I thought those were two totally different characters. Huh. The power of a mask, am I right? I, I mean, I guess we'll explore the zone before we go fight the big monkey. Why not? Ow. He gives you the name, Sekiro. No one else calls you that. Oh. Is that so? I have no idea. Do you have the dragon horn? I don't think I have the dragon horn. I didn't know there was a dragon horn. What does it do? Where do you get it? Tell me more. Of these horny dragon things. Eh. Ugh. 
Ugh. Hey, I got an idea. Let's make a From Software game and let's put a poison swamp in it. Every fucking game, I swear. Dragon horn kills you when you use it. I have an item that does that, but it's not a dragon horn. It's a tooth called bite down, and it insta kills you when you use it. How do you get the dragon horn? Care to purchase an offering? Another one. Yeah. Yeah, I'll take those. I'll take that. I don't need any more of your shit. Where you ever... ever wonder why the game give you such a tool? Uh... I mean... Kind of? But... I understand that it's a reusable version of the, what's that stuff called, the instant, it's just a reusable version of the bite down, which could kill you maybe if you get stuck somewhere, or, I don't know, maybe I haven't thought about it that much. Gen Z kids. More so since they already gave you a tool to call back. Yeah. I mean, I'm curious. What the thinking was. Ow. Son of a bitch. What? Ow! Holy ball sacks. Fucking really, you stupid little cunt. Fucking ugh. Goddamn monkeys. Tough monkey. Get up, secure up. Okay, how, how you like my flaming axe, bitch? Uh, more so since they already read that. When you use the tool to die, you get to res as usual, but doing it this way will not time out your res orbs, meaning you can create space at will via death. Yes, I did actually watch a YouTube video on that. But it's a... Uh, what a niche mechanic. I Like, I can see how it's useful, but I can't imagine, like, actually working that into, like, a combat rotation. But I, I very much appreciate the concept of it. I would love to see somebody actually use that, utilize that in combat. Gen Z is the current generation of kids? Yes. Uh, any inconvenience and they say that they want to kill themselves. <laughs> I don't know if that's true, but it certainly is funny. <laughs> yeah, Gen Z kids and millennials just have no will to live. Well, how often do you die at the feet of a boss? Uh, I mean, pretty often, I guess. Whoa! Fucking cunt.
<laughs> Bitch, please. And they don't go far enough for a useful res. Hmm. Make the monkey dance, please. I want to see it. Um, do I even have that ninjutsu yet? Oh, I do have puppeteer. I'll try and make the monkey dance for you. You use it when you're very low. Just jump back, distance, and die. Eh, I could see it. What the fuck was that in the wall? Uh, I think it's some sort of ghost. Or something. I don't know. I'll try putting the hidden tooth on my bar. Maybe there'll be a moment where... Uh, It'll come in useful. Uh, the snake's blocking my way. Nope. Sorry. Sorry, crows. I can't get back through. Otherwise, I would make the monkey dance. I tried. Oh, never mind. I can get back through. Fancy. Where does this come up? Oh, this puts you in here. Fancy. Okay. I mean, I've already been there, so... We good. This does sort of bring some continuity between the, uh... The areas where you fight the two different ape bosses. Well, the same ape boss. But the areas, the boss rooms are sort of connected because of this cave, so that's kind of cool. I didn't know the snake was down here. Yeah! You get something called the dried snake viscera. I'm not sure what you do with it. A dried persimmon like heart of a great serpent. The great serpent is a god of the land, and the heart is believed to be where one's spirit resides. Well, it looks much like a persimmon. In fact, this is. The red viscera of a god. Apparently, denizens of the Sunken Valley worship the organs, believing they represent the deity itself. I don't know what to do with it, but I do know where to get it. <laughs> it's not a From Software game till you go into poison swamp areas. Well, yeah, you're not wrong. It is kind of a tradition. It's for the dragon homecoming ending. Huh. That's good to know. I don't know how to utilize it, though. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. All right, I think we're ready to fight a big-ass monkey. Shit. This guy's hard. Hello. Grab attack. Ow. Ah! What is happening? Oh my god. Ow. Dickhead. Oh shit, grab attack. My bad. My bad. Alright. 
Now. Damn it. tried to dodge. It didn't go well. The ending mainly has you eating rice and giving the girl two snake hearts to eat. Interesting. Huh. He will give his poop and fart on you, lol. Oh, he did. Fire is good against the ape. Ah. I tell you half these bosses are wrestling fans. Yeah. Let's try... Ba, 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 ba. Flame vent? I guess. Let's get a little red candy going on, too. supposed to dodge that, man. Oh dear. Well, my aggressive strategy is almost working. I tell you, half these bosses. Uh, I already read that. To a degree, the bosses in this game feel like Mega Man bosses. Interesting. Use it after you get him to three quarters uh, to half of his health. Okay. There's always one skill or tool to make them trivial. I don't know about trivial. I'd say it helps, though. What if there was a first fight from some... What if there was a first fight fighting from some from soft game that would be hard, no weapons, just combat? That sounds cool. I would want to play it. They could make anything, and I'll play it. You staggered him out of a fart. <sighs> That's how good I am. Just that good. Oh, shit. Really? 
Come on. He doesn't seem to mind the fire very much. There we go. Okay, if you can actually light him, it's really good. Stand corrected. Having the skills to light your blade on fire makes it better. How do you do that? Is it a skill in one of the trees, like the prosthetic tree? I should probably get further away from him. Ow! Fucking could have sworn I blocked that. You were done. My bad. Oh, 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 oh. Confetti. Oh, 
Oh my god! Bitch. Show me that centipede. <laughs> Re so many reeds. I love it. <laughs> Should have made you fight him on a snowy mountain. Yeah, it would have been better. Alright, let's go grab our pretty white flower, shall we? <laughs> I re after every scream, midway re. <laughs> Perfect. Lotus of the Palace, a white lotus flower found blooming in the depths of the sunken valley where the fountainhead waters pool deeply. The flower's aroma attracts female apes. Thus the guardian ape carefully tend to it so as to offer it to his bride. One of the incense ingredients sought by the divine heir for a myrtle severance. Fancy. Maybe in the DLC. Maybe. I believe there's a little pond over here to explore. Precious bait. I think we can trade that for carp scales if I remember. Is there anything else? Nah. Alright, well, that was fun. Also, the skill is in the prosthetic tree. Oh, cool. Let's go look at it. Can't be this one. I'm guessing it's prosthetic arts. Living force. Acquiring shinobi martial arts living force allows one to perform a follow-up attack with certain tools and abuse the weapon with the tool's effect. Oh, cool. All right, now we have something to look forward to. The sculptor, eh, I don't need to read the rest. All right, four skill points. That seems fucking worth it. Um, I'm not gonna farm those out until we get to a better farming spot though in the end game. So why don't we travel back to Le Castle and give the kid the flower and see what he wants us to do next. DLC better have a mood light prosthetic? Hell yeah. I'm all about that. So you've met with Yes. For defeating. I see. To think that Lord Genichiro would rejuvenate. That's what I'm sure. The rich <laughs> one, <laughs> my men. Uh -huh. I'm not wrong. Did you? I did. And we've. I, see. I thank you. I've come and I will. Pro okay. Bye. Also, the, I already read that last one. If you get. Scattered flame, it makes the flame on your sword blue. Ooh, cool. Or is that sacred flame? Sacred flame makes the sword on your flame on your sword blue. Very cool. Wolf, look here. I found something that may help us. It's a stone. A stone? Yes, look at this. Ooh. What is? It's a writing. By one who sought the fountain had aroma. It says there's a sacred village with a stone that gives off a unique scent. Pretty sure I have that. What is huh? What is that strangely shaped rock you hold? Is that the fragrant stone of the fountainhead? My lord, this stone appeared to have been enshrined. Yes. It is just a Yes. A sweetly scent written on the old bridle. What sort of It was in a cave beyond hmm. No way to know. Sweetly. Hmm? Lord Kuro. That. Hmm. Sweetly scented. That is what it might. Oh, I found. I discovered there's another. Thing. What is it? The blood of the divine heir. Your blood, but my lord. Yes. It is, however. In Lord Gen. And it appears. For now, I'd like to. Now then. We just need. Perhaps we should. Have... Hmm. Yes. Okay. 
Uh, the lose light upgrade for the flame vent. Very cool. Yes, we should be able to get the other two upgrades this playthrough. And then we'll have them all. Have you seen the sculptor lately? Yeah. All I know is what Doki that the dragon's heritage, mm -hmm. however, repeated mm -hmm. a disease mm -hmm. he knew much. Mm -hmm. Forgive me. Mm -hmm. Is there a way to... I do not know. I am unsure. Well, thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I like. What is it? Please. What? Hmm. This white. No. Then. That more perhaps. Hmm. Are you done? Yes, I'm sorry. <laughs> Just looking at my face. Okay. Goodbye. My lord. I... Oh? Yes. So uh -huh, you... uh -huh, uh -huh. Here's the flower. To think my blood isn't... Perhaps Lady Emma will know. Might you ask her? Fucking A. I just talked to her. Emma. There is something I... Yes, what is... In the divine air. Why would you... S the blood of the... To obtain and achieve... Uh -huh. Oh, uh -huh. it is... How The mortal... Yes, uh -huh. here you are. This was written by... It was with the... You may wound... I see. Mm -hmm. This brings mm -hmm. and I shall tell... Of course. Wolf, did you... Speak? I did. And? What did she say? That it could be... I see. So the mortal... As you wish. I've heard the mortal blade. Will you obtain it? As you wish. I see you've gathered. Keep up the good work. Alright. So, we need to go get the mortal blade, which means we need to go fight the folding screen monkeys. But I can't remember how to get there. Um, the lose light upgrade goes through guard, and it's better against apparitions but no longer applies fire. Oh, interesting. That's good to know. Um, so you go to Senpu Temple to fight the monkeys. And, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You just ring this bell. That's what it is. We're making good progress today. I'm glad I didn't get stuck on that ape. I sure as hell did the first time I fought him. Look at that outfit. It's beautiful. The ape is tedious the first time. Yeah, I could not figure his shit out. I was on him for like hours. But I got there eventually. One of the panels is empty. <sighs> Having essentially an infinite supply of divine confetti makes life a lot easier. I like a weapon buffs. Yeah, I got you, bitch. <laughs> now, get back here, you whore. There's little tricks to killing them all that I'm gonna have to remember. This fight took me an embarrassingly long time my first time too. <laughs> I never use it against him. Genchiro's sugar helps her here. Genchiro's sugar. Oh, that's a good idea.
or Genshin's Sugar. I don't know why I keep reading all the names as the same thing. <laughs> it's not racist. Shut up, you're racist. Fuck these monkeys is. The terror monkey sometimes drops pellets. Also, this is basically the worst version of the witch boss fight. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, from from a lore perspective, it's pretty cool. But from a gameplay perspective, it's kind of meh. Not that I'm complaining. Just, just saying. Shit. Here, you little bitch. Man, you're fast. Ugh. Fuck. Spirit fall doesn't last as long. Oh, that's also good to know. That's very good to know. I'm learning all the things today. Can, oh my god, grapple. Nerd. I've actually only gotten a single spirit fall. I can't stand the headless. Yeah, I did them all my first playthrough just because I wanted to do everything, but the headless are kind of a pain in the ass. I won't disagree with you there. I hear them slapping around down there. Yeah. Need to chase one into that room, I guess. When I did fight them, I used the purple umbrella. Interesting. What does the purple umbrella do? I've never really used any of the umbrellas. Loaded umbrella. Emblazoned with purplish blue phoenix. Cosprey limbs when spread open, it will protect against attacks from all directions, holding it out while moving to protect from light attacks. 
Blessings of the Phoenix. Fill the umbrella, preventing damage from apparition-type enemies. Interesting. Ooh. I mean, it's pretty. I'll give you that. This up, other monkey. No! God damn it! Alright. Three down. Oh, it's useful against the headless, not monkeys. Gotcha. That makes more sense. I was like, man, I didn't think... <laughs> we needed specific prosthetics for the monkey fight. Ah! Holy shit! Those things do terror. Alright. Cool. Noted. this last bitch at I need to look up like an efficient pattern for doing this fight because I never want to do this again just running around blindly this is tedious yeah It's up your butt. It's an anal monkey. Well, shit. That's what that sensation is. the hell are you? <laughs> Sensation? Okay, then. <laughs> oh, there he is, there he is. Sugar. Shit. Come on, Sekiro, run faster. over. <laughs> so Kaijo could get them? Of course he could. Please, forgive them. They only sought to keep me hidden. Nope. Show me your face. Close your eyes. Let us meet at the inner sanctum. Eat the child's rice. Okay. I didn't eat it last time. I gave it to the old lady. 
And all she fucking did was tell me about an item that I already had. So I'm gonna eat it myself. Pretty. A attack power. Yeah. Nice. Sorry, AP at uh, 20, 20 and 20. Feels good, man. It's really good healing. Oh, maybe I'll save that for a boss fight then. Why do you seek this place? I seek the mortal blade. Do you know of the blade that cannot be drawn? Yes. It is so called, for not one who has drawn it has ever survived. Yet you still wish to attempt this. Yeah, girl. Danger's my middle name. I see. Very well. If you are prepared, you may gaze upon the blade. Something funny and annoying to hear Westerners talk about Eastern culture. <laughs> I believe you. Is it, I wonder? Are they not loath to die? <gasps> How? How are you? Child, what the fuck? Your eye. I see. You carry the curse of the dragon's heritage. The mortal blade, without question. A. I accept its power. Nido Mosquito. I Give me some rice. You serve the divine heir of the dragon's heritage. Yes. Why do you seek the mortal blade? I wish to obtain the dragon tears from the divine realm. To sever the ties of immortality. I see. I have read about this. I have read there is a way to sever the dragon's heritage. Mm. Which means the divine heir begrudges the power of the dragon's heritage. That's right. How strange fate can be. I am one of the children of the rejuvenating water created. Uh -huh. uh -huh. I am the uh -huh. others. Uh -huh. I, I do yep. but the uh -huh. trend yeah, 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 yeah. I have yeah, 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 yeah. less. Cool. He said to gaze, not touch the blade. Oops. Should have made the mortal blade Ludwig's holy blade. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's a mod for that. I'll probably get that soon. Rice, fancy. This is rice. rice. There you are. Rice is a taste. All right, thanks, kid. Shinobi. Farewell, Shinobi. May the harvest. Wait, did you have an Shinobi. option for me? Give holy chapter infested. Yeah. This is for you. What is? I was told. Thank you. I will. Huh? What's wrong? I cannot. Give I me more rice. The rice is. I shall give. Farewell. May the heart. Dope. Become Orin. You got it. All right. Progression has been achieved, chaps. But I work today. 
and I want to relax a little bit, watch some Big Bang Theory. So I'm going to call the stream there. And uh, thank you all for chilling. Appreciate you guys. Love your faces. And uh, we will be streaming tomorrow on YouTube, Bloodborne. And it's going to be great. So be there or be square. All right. Night Crows, Night V9. Thanks for chilling, guys. See you next time. Bye bye. Night, Maria. <laughs>